Ooh. Dragon! Bad dragon! <laughs> Ooh, Street Fighter. Capcom. Oh! <laughs> this is Dragon's Dogma, but it's not Dragon's Dogma 2. It's Dragon's Dogma Online. Whoa. Not split screen, by the way. Um, uh, it's an MMO, free to play MMO now. Really? So, in a way, they've um, just kind of signed the death warrant of Dragon's yeah. Dogma yeah. As, a, as a franchise, possibly. Are they still going to make. They've regular said nothing games? about making more regular or, games. I don't know what you call them. I think that it's possible that my fears have been confirmed that deep down is too similar to Dragon's Dogma for two it to exist as yeah. their own they'll cannibalize each other. They're both from Capcom. And that's kinda sad because anybody who Dragon's Dogma was a sleeper hit. It really had a a, a, a something to it that like no other game had really captured for me. Mm -hmm. Was it Dragons? No, it, it was, was just the like, dogma. It was the asynchronous dogs? multiplayer. It was the fact was it that um, I don't know if you guys remember how it worked or anything. What happens uh, yeah, is bit, okay. y it's you and a pawn. That's your party. Yeah. That's your party is you and oh, one other yes, guy. Yes, yes. And the guy is artificial intelligence uh, that just follows you around. He's your pawn, and um, he, when you're not playing, can be summoned by other players <laughs> using Shinji items to come fight for them. So your party is actually three people. Always you, your pawn, and oh wait, no, four. Two other people's pawns. So like, Weird. you have three AI. One is your pet, and the other two other people. And um, it was cool because he would come back with tips based on the adventures he'd had with other mm. people. Cool. He would know because he's been in this dungeon yeah, that, that is such a danger cool awaits. And then people could send back gifts with the pawn. So Dragon's Dogma had this distinct feeling of like, you know, sort of like loneliness because you're just this lone adventurer with this like sort of the pawns distinctly act weird kind of like almost ghost like like they're they're intelligent but they're almost like not super analytical or anything and it's weird they just don't seem human they seem like almost robotic uh -huh. but because you have like you almost feel like you're being kept company by the people who shared your pawn who had them over to their key party. <laughs> yeah, um, it's a lot of pun fucking. Mm -hmm. The other thing I have to comment on is how the fact that the character design in this is just nothing like Dragon's Dogma. Everybody looks, well, the monsters look awesome, but all the characters look very generic and typical yeah. anime. Yeah, yeah they do. JRPG types with vanilla faces and plain cleft jaws for men and soft, beautiful faces for women and nothing really special. So it, it it just feels like an ill use of what could have been a really strong new franchise. Mm. Yeah, that's a bummer. You love I Dragon's loved it. Dogma. I hope this doesn't mean the death uh, of it, but it free to play MMO. Yeah. God damn it. Yeah. Well, it didn't kill Final Fantasy, but it also had about 20 years to strengthen before <laughs> they did it to yeah. it. Yeah. We'll be back after this with more video games, Austin awesome live show and trailer.